I like to support other artists when I can, and so I bought a lot of courses from Udemy, sometimes just to support the artist and other times to get inspiration or, or get little tips. And what I've decided I'm going to do is recently I bought this course on Udemy called Post-Apocalyptic Classroom. And I'm going through this. Now, uh, the guy who does this uh, models in Max, and he's going to uh, eventually uh, do some texturing in Substance Painter and create some damage and stuff like that. And what I thought I would do is sort of see how it goes if I was to follow the, the video and create something similar. And I'm not going to do exactly the same, but I'm going to use a lot of the same, the same concepts and some of the same... Uh, you know model type structures and uh, i thought i'd follow the course and also do my version of the post-apocalyptic classroom so i will try to uh, link you to the course if you're interested maybe we can get some support for the artist and we'll see how it goes as i follow along this it's it's not going to be difficult to model it should be for relative beginners and then we'll do some substance painter stuff and bring it back into blender and see how it looks all right, so that's going to be a new series on the post-apocalyptic classroom. I'm really into this uh, genre, and I need more practice. And so uh, let's do this and sort of follow the Udemy course to some extent and, and see if we can come up with some, some nice uh, uh, results uh, as if you're following a tutorial by somebody else and by me at the same time, if that makes sense. All right, so starting soon. Hope you'll join me.